A great question I've been asked is, if I upgraded Photoshop and I want to downgrade it again, is it possible to do so? In this episode, I want to show you exactly how to downgrade Photoshop so you can get back to working in case the version that you upgraded to has any issues. For example, a lot of the people have said that in the most recent update of Photoshop 2017, there's been some issues with a few people in terms of the graphics. They might see blocks happening across their image when they use solid color adjustment layers. Granted, this doesn't happen to everyone. And even if it happens to like 0.1% of people or 0.0001% of people, when you multiply that by the number of users out there, it's a lot of people. And in case this happens to you, just know that it's related to the version of Photoshop. And if you downgrade it again, or if you download a previous version, it will probably be solved, especially if it worked in the version that you had before upgrading. So this episode, let me show you how to do that. So let's just jump into it and show you how it works. The first thing that you want to do is make sure you locate Adobe Creative Cloud. Whether you're using Mac or PC, this is operated by different methods. So first of all, if you're on a Mac, just hit Command Spacebar and hit Creative Cloud, and you should see it pop up. If you're on a PC, go to your program files, and there you'll see Creative Cloud located in your system. Now, once you have it open, it's probably going to ask you to update Creative Cloud in case it's not up to date on the latest versions. Once you have done that, you should see over here under Installed Apps, under My Apps and Services, it'll say Photoshop CC. Once you've located that, you may or may not see an arrow on the left hand side. What this arrow basically means is that you have other versions of Photoshop installed already, which in this case is probably a good thing. If you don't see it, all you need to do is click on this drop down button here next to update, go to manage, click on other versions, and there you see other versions that you can install with Photoshop. I personally recommend the top one over here. This is obviously going to change based on the time that you're watching this video. So if you're watching this in the year 2022 when Photoshop hopefully is still there, you, you should see other versions located here. So just install the most recent one or the one that you want to install, obviously, that you think you want to uh, get more familiar with. However, this is the actual panel that you go to install the most recent version of Photoshop um, aside from the one that you have. Hopefully you found this video helpful. If you did, please subscribe, leave a comment below and let me know what else you want to see on this channel because I love making videos. And um, if there's any topic that you want to hear about, let me know. All right, peace. I'll see you in the next one.